Greetings. Have you heard of the once great Volok family? I'm the last of my line. No, I suppose not. My family's been involved in things I'm not proud of. That's part of the reason I returned to Mournhold. I'm here to reclaim my family home. It's been sealed since my father died, when we fled the city for Vardenfell. I was so little then, but I promised I would return. My family kept Argonian slaves. They worked our salt rice plantation and were the source of our wealth and the cause of our doom. When the pact freed our slaves, they rose up and murdered my father. My mother and I fled. A shadow hangs over my family. My mother returned last year to claim our property. I never saw her again. She was murdered. I'm sure of it. Now, I think someone is following me. I can handle myself, but I'm still worried. Frankly, I'd welcome your company. The family townhouse is nearby. I'll meet you there. for meeting me here. I'm glad I don't have to face this alone. Well, let's see what's left of the old place. I see. You're in on it. I suppose there's no way around it then. that glint. Finally, the Volats have paid for their crimes, thanks to you. Thank you, stranger. With his dark act behind us, we can get on with our lives. No elves will own me or my family again. The Volocks have all been slain, but Eyes That Glint is still dead. We are as bad as the Volocks.
You killed one of my gang, Swit. No writ will... That's it. Kill the Morag Tong and any witnesses. I'll just take my leave. No use getting my axes bloody. Yeah. I had that situation under control. Just needed them to make the first hostile move. Still, I cleaned enough blood off my axes for one day, so thanks for lending a hand. You were, were you? Was it Melissa? I told her I'd close out my tab after I completed another contract. That woman has the patience of an anxious nix. Well, tell her I'm good for it. I'll stop by and we can conclude our business cordially. Veya, the new apprentice. Now, why in oblivion do you care about Veya? Are you now? And why do you want to do that? Uh, never mind, I don't really care. I was asked to pass along some notes, but I'm not really the messenger type. I suggest you talk to Veya's mentor. Last I heard, she had a job in the Western Ruins. Make sure you don't anger Veya's mentor, or even look at her the wrong way. She's grown surprisingly protective of that young woman, and if she thinks you pose a danger... Besides, I'd hate to see you wind up on the wrong end of one of our writs. You know the usual buyer's remorse. I see a lot of that in my line of work. Turns out, I had to kill a bad man who did bad things. The writ was legal, above board. Unfortunately, his brother didn't see it that way and was looking for revenge. Oh, you make it sound so... obscene. Still, that's pretty much an accurate description. But it's not like I work for the Dark Brotherhood or anything. I don't kill anyone without a sanctioned writ. Keeps the great houses in line. It's a calling. I'd rather not. She's particular about her secrets and I don't want to get on a bad side. You should keep that in mind, too, if you plan to continue on this course. Veya's mentor usually sticks to the rules, but I wouldn't turn my back on her. Dog. What happened? Let me see. I just tried to pet him. You shouldn't be here. Didn't you read the House Redoran proclamation? I wouldn't be here myself, but. Some of my miners are still in there. Our mine was invaded by violent cultists. They showed up and 
and just took the place over. My people are trapped. I'm no expert, but it looked like the cultists were preparing to conduct a ritual before the Ashlander interrupted them. Probably because I heard one of them say, with this ritual we'll call forth a mystical weapon and attain the power of a god, or something along those lines. Look, I was just trying to get me and my miners out of there when the Ashlander showed up. Well, I, I never actually saw an Ashlander, but I heard a cultist yell, Ashlander thief, that's our mystical weapon. That's not an exact quote, but you get the idea. I don't know what happened after that. I was kind of busy trying not to die. It used to be an ore mine, and we hope it will be again. My crew was inside, preparing to start up mining operations when the cultists attacked. The way things are going, we might just have to turn the place into another Kwama egg mine. die in the shame I brought to Malakath. <coughs> Defeated by a lone warrior. Oh, Malakath will laugh at our incompetence. An assassin. Probably a Morag Tong. She tracked our leader here. But she... She doesn't know. We set a trap... inside the ruins. Oh. She's just one woman! Get inside the ruins and stop her!
Let the assassin come. I'm tired of running and she doesn't frighten me. turning up at the most unusual moments, don't you, hero? Questions? I don't have time for questions. I have a writ to complete. Look, I can't keep these evil cultists waiting. You want to talk? Find me after I finish this job. Hero, you really need to stop eating like this. Come out, little assassin! Or is the Mora tongue too scared to meet the powerful snake face to face? See an orc about a writ. Don't kill me. I tried to interfere with House Tobani's plans. I made a mistake. A mistake? Well, that explains everything. I'll just let the Talzani know. I'm sure Mage Valen will understand. Oh, that's a relief. I thought for sure you were going to kill me. I am. <laughs> oh, I hate when my leathers get wet. And this is a new outfit, too. Ah, oh, well. I suppose we ought to discuss what you're doing here. I have to admit, when I saw you, I thought, Husk, are you doing down here? Pardon my orcish. Did you really follow me across the continent? That shows commitment. Kind of creepy, but still a lot of commitment. Well, that's not what I expected. But you can just turn around and leave. You're not going to find her. Faye is going through a difficult time right now. 
And the last thing she needs is some house brethren lackey adding to her pain and confusion. I know you, hero. It's old man Eris I don't trust. He didn't tell you about Vea's brother, did he? How House Redoran exiled their favorite son. No? I didn't think so. Vea deserves answers, and I promise to help her. You need to just walk away. Outsiders? Is her father really that desperate? Look, tell Eris that Vea's safe and you'll see her soon. But no more outsiders. If my organization gets skittish, they'll return to the shadows and take Vea with them. They'll only deal with you. Well, it's not exactly a lie, and I don't want things to get out of hand. I'll arrange a meeting, provided Vea agrees. You let Eris know she's safe. Get him to stop hiring freelancers before someone gets hurt. I'll send word when we're ready. That was poetry in motion. Not only is my organization getting choice assignments again, but we're starting to recover some of our prestige. Specifically, these Malakath cultists interfered with House Telvani, so they had to be dealt with. Oh, him? No one special. Just the leader of this particular band of mad cultists. His name was on the writ, so I had to end him. It's what I do, after all, and I do it so well. I suppose if you're in for a sliver, you might as well be in for the log. I'm with the Morog Tong, and what you witnessed was a legal murder. According to my writ, the orc had to die. So, I killed him. Now, if you don't mind, I need to get back to Vea. Vea and I have a history. A brother, too. They were good kids like to watch me train. Now I feel responsible for her. When she came to me looking for help and asked to join the Morag Tong, who was I to refuse? That was her decision, not mine. Bay is good with a blade and tracks like a Lord Ranger. She's a natural at this, and it gives me a chance to keep an eye on her. So now I'm her mentor and she's my apprentice. I wouldn't have it any other way. Try not to be super. 